My name is Julie Plant. I'm the head women's basketball coach. First job out of college was a graduate assistant women's basketball coach at Elmira College. I was a GA, the head JV coach, and the assistant varsity coach. I think for me, um, aside from getting to work with our student athletes who are awesome people, um, it's really the people that I get to work with day in and day out. Um, the community, um, the environment, it's just uh, really supportive um, and it, it, it's a fun place to be. Uh, what brought me to St. Anselm was an opportunity to um, coach at the Division II level. I was a Division III head coach um, and I was always really uh, impressed with watching the play in the Northeast 10 and I thought it would be a really a great opportunity to get to coach at that level. My favorite memories so far coaching at St. Anselm um, would have to be uh, watching the NCAA tournament selection show this year with my team um, and having our name called and earning the first bid in the program's history in, I think since 1999 and, and just getting to see the, the looks on my kids faces how excited they were and, and kind of how our, our hard work has really paid off the past three years and getting to that point. It's a pretty cool moment. Outside of coaching, some of my favorite things to do, um, I love going hiking with my dog, my dog Callie, she's a little bulldog, she's a, she's a lot of fun, um, I like exercising, um, I love going to movies. Uh, what made me decide to get into coaching um, was early on, uh, I did a lot of teaching, substitute teaching, my father's a teacher, my, grandmother's, my grandmother was a teacher, um, so I have a lot of... Uh, um, teachers in my family. Um, so I did a lot of substitute teaching uh, when I was in college, um, minored in education, took a lot of courses in education, got my master's in general education, so I kind of really enjoyed, uh, enjoyed that environment but really fell in love with sports so I wanted to try to find something that I could kind of do both out. And coaching is it's teaching so um, I really enjoyed getting to work with a motivated athlete um, in a different type of a classroom. So it just kind of, it just kind of fit for me. My favorite professional sports team is by far the Boston Celtics. I used to grow up um, watching them with my dad uh, and he let me stay up a little later at night when they were on in the evenings. So I was a huge Larry Bird, Kevin McHale, Robert Parrish fan um, and continue to follow them and I've been really impressed with, uh, with Danny Ainge and, and Coach Brad Stevens and, and the job that they're doing. My all-time professional favorite athlete, I have a, I have a few. Um, I grew up watching Jennifer Azey play uh, at Stanford, loved watching her play in Don Staley at Virginia. And it's so cool that they're both, uh, they're, they're both coaches now and I follow their careers. Uh, I spend my time on bus trips. Um, mostly watching film of my team and breaking down film and preparing for our next opponents. Um, but I also am an avid uh, series watcher. I watch all kinds of different TV shows, um, Showtime series, HBO series, Netflix series, like all kinds of different series. Uh, the last book I read was um, Parenting Brain Types. I've been doing a lot of research in psychology and learning how, uh, how to help coach, teach, um, different people's brain types. We're all innately wired in a certain way. Um, so learning more about how I can better serve my student athletes based on how they think. If I could go to any one concert, it would definitely be Salt and Pepper. Uh, my biggest athletic achievement as a coach I think happens every year when my student athletes graduate. I mean that's why we're in this business. We want to help support our kids academically and athletically and help them be prepared for where they're going next. So every year I kind of enjoy that day.